Hey guys, we're doing a Q&A. That didn't sound sarcastic at all, right? Anyways, uh, yeah, we're doing a Q&A. Um, and this Q&A, uh, I had a, I had multiple different days for throughout multiple different days. I uh, had a poll or not a poll, like a question thing set up um for people to ask questions about my film i got like uh 13 response and um i have it all of them on my ipad screenshot them all because <laughs> i'm that professional <laughs> and yeah uh, i'm gonna be answering some of y'all's questions about um uh, my ultimate spider-man film and the trailer and whatever this might bring so uh yeah let's get on to the juicy stuff <laughs> all right so we're starting off with Kind of a strong one, I guess. Um, this one was from Brayden the Filmmaker, um, and uh, he's a pretty cool dude. Go check out his film, uh, Spider-Man Something Sinister. It's a pretty cool film, I highly recommend it. I watched it on premiere. I was literally on a call with him. It was pretty cool. Um, but yeah, all right, so he says, will Spidey have a love interest in the film? I'm gonna say this flat out to y'all, no. There are really only gonna be like two characters in the whole film, Spider-Man and the Green Goblin. Yeah, it's it's pretty much confirmed that it's the Green Goblin by now. It, yeah, it's the Green Goblin, okay? It's the Green Goblin! Speaking of the Green Goblin, uh, Fantasy King asked, who's playing Green Goblin? Yeah, also, um, Aeon Chowdhury, uh, also asked this, like, the same question. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna answer it. <laughs> and, uh, I can't really answer that now that I'm saying that out loud. Uh, I, I had an an- I, I, I don't have an answer for that. I cannot tell you who is playing Green Goblin yet. You, uh, you guys will all get an update of who's playing him because hopefully soon, soon, I hope, we can get the Green Goblin actor. I mean, I know who it is, but y'all don't. I'm just saying. He's a pretty cool dude. He is a pretty cool dude. The, the person who's playing Green Goblin, he's a pretty cool dude. He's a pretty cool dude. Will this be a series? I cannot confirm or, nor deny. I don't really know. Like, I would love to do a show, but I'm still, I'm still more focused on this short film. I want to get it done. I want to do so many things with the character of Spider-Man, but I'm not sure, like, with this version of Spider-Man, like, I would love to do, like, I would love to recreate the black suit arc from Ultimate. The the mess with MJ getting thrown off the bu the bridge, um, and, um, maybe the Clone Saga, and then also, like, the death of Spider-Man. I would love to do the death of Spider-Man, but right now, like, after the Ultimate Spider-Man films comes out, like after that short film comes out, I'm gonna take a little bit of a break from Spider-Man films. I, I kind of want to like maybe experiment with um, my uh, filming type. Like what is my type of filming? Like how do I film? Like what is my pursuit in filming? Because when I grow up, I want to be a director um, and an actor. Um, and I just want to find my foot in all of this. So uh, yeah, uh, that's your answer. <laughs> That's your answer. So Aeon asks, when is the film releasing? Honestly, I can't really say much on it. I will try to give y'all a date. It's gonna be around winter time. And I'll say, oh, it's not around Christmas. No, it's after Christmas. It's not coming out around Christmas. I'm thinking it might be either late January and beyond, man. That, that That's probably when this film is gonna come out. Either in near the end of January or February or March. That's really when I want this film to come out. I think it would be so cool to just get my film out there for everyone to see around then. I think that'd be pretty cool. Um, but uh, yeah, so uh, my buddy Spider Kid Studios asks, what is the runtime of the film? Uh, I'm only like five pages in on the script. I pretty much already have the entire vision of how the uh, story's gonna play out. So it's probably gonna be around 10 to 15 minutes, I'd say. Um, but yeah, um, also because it's Spider Kid Studios, be sure to go check out his channel. Actually, go check out all these guys' channels. Um, and I'll try to get all their channels in the description. Also, another thing about Spider Kid Studios, he is my uh, VFX and CGI artist. Please, go give this man support. I, I mean it. Like, he is working his butt off on this film. He's still working on Green Goblin, and I am loving it. Like, he is doing spectacular job a spectacular job links will hopefully be in the description um but yeah i swear this guy's awesome but uh yeah anyways next question okay um next question is from my good buddy busk studio go check out his film uh spray and vast power i mean it's not out but um 
he uh he's he's got some pretty cool updates on instagram it's the film is probably gonna turn out so good like i'm, ex I'm excited man like um but yeah he asks any easter eggs or references to other heroes sadly probably not <laughs> uh like yeah I, I haven't really had time to like put in references and stuff and like even when i get the script done i'm probably not gonna have references in this because it's like short story quick to the point. Next question from Brayden the Filmmaker. What do you think this film's impact in the fan film community will be? Honestly, I can definitely say it's not gonna be the next Spider-Man Lotus. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna be a giant impact. Like this might, it might be my most popular upload, but that's about it. I don't, I don't really, I don't know how much attention it's gonna get. Like it might get attention from a few people like um, uh, Party Boy Studios, like Peter um, from Party Boy Studios. He follows me on Instagram and so does Tough Cookie Media. Um, well, Tough Cookie Cosplay, but he's also Tough Cookie, Cookie Media. Um, but yeah, those two guys who also make fan films, they might see it. Well, they might see my uh, film. Uh, but other than that, I don't think there's gonna be many other people who are gonna see it. Like, I would, I would lose my mind, absolutely lose my mind, if if Lonely Spider Buckeye Studios like watched it and like comments it on. I would lose my mind. Like, I would go. But. Yeah, um, uh, yeah, I think it's gonna be more of, like, a, uh, light impact on the fan film community. Like, they might be like, oh, yeah, you wanna see Ultimate Spider-Man live action. Here you go. Um, but other than that, it's not gonna have revalue. Like, I'm still pouring my, my heart and soul into this. I do wanna film in my school, though. I just haven't had, like, haven't been allowed yet. <laughs> but, yeah, I was, like, working on freaking storyboards in school. Um, but, yeah, that was, a uh, that was, a. Uh, yeah, that, yeah, I'm, uh, two more questions. All right, final two, let's go. All right, one of the last questions, um, Brayden the Filmmaker asks, I swear, this is his last one, I swear, this is his last question. He's been asking so many questions. Will Spider-Man appear in the film? No, no, I've been joking with you guys this whole time. Big Wheel's the main character. Frick, Spider-Man, it's Big Wheel. Big Wheel! So, uh, Spider-Man Nerd 2009, or Spider-Boy on Instagram, uh, says, are you gonna go live with games? Um, honestly, man, uh, currently, I haven't really thought of that, um, because, first of all, I don't have, like, a PlayStation or an Xbox or a PS5 or anything like that. I have a Switch, and I wouldn't really want to go live with games like that. I want to go live with like, you know, Spider-Man games and Marvel games in general, superhero games, just games I enjoy. Um, but uh, I would really only go for it, like, just, it would basically be his background, like, be like, oh yeah, I'm playing this game, but uh, I could talk to you guys about what I've been up to lately. Like, I, those would be those kinds of videos. Like, that's mainly the reason why I would do uh, live streams with games. That was a good question. Thank you. And that does it for the q and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys like my stuff, I guess, you could like and subscribe, I guess. Like, I don't really know. But yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, be sure to ask if you guys like these Q&As and ask if I should do any more. Um, but uh, yeah, see you guys later. Peace.